to start projecting content wirelessly from your Windows or Mac PC. We first need to install Panasonic Wireless Manager software on your computer. You can either download the software from the Panasonic Global website or install using the CD-ROM supplied with selected projectors. The latest version is available on our website. Today, we will demonstrate how to connect using a Windows PC. Next, let's set up the projector. First, turn the projector on. Wireless Manager has four connection modes, Simple, S-Direct, M-Direct, and User Mode. Simple mode provides an easy connection to your computer, tablet, and smartphone. S-Direct is recommended when you want to connect the projector and a computer. M-Direct is best when connecting the projector through any network using a security key. Please select User Mode when connecting to an existing network or access point. Today, we'll demonstrate how to connect using Simple Mode. Press Menu on the remote controller to show the on-screen display and select Network USB in the Projector's Settings menu. Then set Wireless LAN to Simple Mode. You can also select S-Direct M-Direct, or User Mode from the same menu. Press the Panasonic App button on your remote controller. A standby screen will be displayed in the projected image. Next, confirm the projector settings information, network ID, projector name, and wireless LAN. Network ID is displayed on the upper left corner. Projector name is shown next to Network ID. This name can be changed to whatever you like, such as venue name. Wireless LAN connection setting is displayed in the bottom left corner. If you're using a flat panel display or a legacy projector without a standby screen, Confirm the setting information in the Input Guidance or Settings menu. Now, let's open Wireless Manager. Double-click the Wireless Manager icon on the desktop. The simple connection screen is displayed. Select the network ID for your projector. Click it. Now your PC and projector should be connected. Next, press the Start button on the Launcher panel. You can now wirelessly mirror your PC screen on the projector screen. This software also has a number of other useful features. These include Shortcut, Multi-Live Mode, Browser Remote Control, web control, and multiple connections. Let's go through each function step by step. You can start projecting quickly using the shortcut function. Click the shortcut creation icon on the simple connection screen. Then click creating shortcut for connection. Double-click the icon you created on the desktop to connect automatically, and the launcher will start up. Click Creating Shortcut for Projection. Double-click the icon created on the desktop to connect automatically, and projection will begin. Now, let's look at how to use Multi-Live Mode. You can display content from multiple devices simultaneously using this function. Click Option on the launcher to open the Option menu. Select Multi Live from the list. Next, you need to choose the style you want to use from Live Style Selection. 
Select your desired style from the pull-down list. Let's select Four Screen Multi Style and click Apply. Click the position icon to arrange where you want each image to appear on screen. Then click Start on the monitor and what's on your computer screen will now be shown on the projection screen. Multi Live Mode has various projection styles. Full Screen Style, Four Screen Multi Style, Four Screen Index Style, and Sixteen Screen Index Style. Multi Live Mode also works with any device including iOS and Android. In addition, you can change where the projected image appears on screen. To do this, click the position of display on projection screen icon. Browser Remote Control lets you operate projectors using buttons displayed in your computer's web browser. Click Option on the launcher and select Remote Controller. The security dialog window will pop up. Enter your ID and password. Browser Remote Control will now appear. You can operate the projector using the buttons on screen. You can also operate the projector using the web control function. Press Option on the launcher and select Web Control. A security dialog window pops up. Enter your ID and password. Click OK to display the projector status window. Then click the Network Status tab. Here, you can confirm projector status in detail. Next. Let's take a look at how we can distribute a media source to multiple projectors or displays. Set to user mode to enable this function. Select search further on the simple connection screen. Click on multi. Next, select multiple projectors. Use. Now, you can transmit content to up to 8 display devices from a single PC. For more information on how to use this software, please visit the Panasonic website.